Yeah, like that sweet corn waffle cone. Honey marshmallow Rocky Road. I got to check that out. Look at this. Strawberry cilantro. Yeah, check it out by Get purchasing a scoop, here. dude. That's why you got to try it. Black, Black olive. Oh, jeez. Nothing. Out of here. Is this, what's it called? Salt and straw. They have some good, but that? <laughs> Come on. You got to try that. The, the, the best is afters. Yeah, you got to try it. Afters yeah. is the best. Yeah, yeah, you got to try it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we're friends that laugh. We're friends that shout. Sometimes we don't know what we're talking about, but that won't stop us. Nothing can stop us. Ooh, yeah. I show you used to love. Just rebranded enough. It's stronger, better, bigger power, cause it Because there's so much stand up, so many premises, so many people doing think what they think is funny things, yeah. and then like as a stand up, you think of things, mm -hmm. and then people are like, "Oh, that's my joke or that whatever." It's just no. It's like parallel thinking is a real thing, and it's more prevalent even now. So, for instance, I don't know if you saw Marlon Wayans' newest special. You probably no. mean you haven't watched. Uh, it. Right? I saw no. clips of it. It's literally all about the Chris Rock slap, right? The gotcha. Jada Pinkett stuff, yeah, it's, right? Yeah, it's about his relationship with Will Smith, mm -hmm. Jada Pinkett, mm -hmm. and Chris Rock. Yeah. It's very vulnerable in, like, you know, wh how mm -hmm. he's talking about it, right? And But anyways, he makes a reference in his uh, special. I make the exact same reference. Right. In your special or just no, on no, stage? No, no, no. But I, yeah. as soon as the Chris Rock thing came out, I was doing material. Yeah. And then I knew, like, this isn't going to last. So I took a chunk of it and I put it on the internet. Yeah. Literally, Before. literally, week of. Oh, Smart. wow. <laughs> yeah. Okay? Smart. Yeah. Like, week of, I did it. And so I saw his thing and I was like, oh, man, this is like the same reference. Mm -hmm. So for me, I'm like, this is my thing. It's on Instagram, it's on TikTok. And I'm like, so I know him. So I hit him up. I go, hey, man, I just wanted you to know that I did this too. Yeah. Because I just don't want any. And also, like, you, yeah, you know he didn't take it from you. Yeah. It's like, but, and you didn't take it from him. That's what I'm saying. It's so, just, it's, yeah. I know, but what it, it just becomes a thing where, like, that's how things start, you know? And, it, dude, this. Online, though, Eric, like, comics know. No, they don't. No, no they, they don't. don't. No, no they comics don't, don't. Oh, really? know. No, no, they, they don't. don't know, dude. I'll tell you why. For his, yeah, I give you another example of this. So I was doing this. I was doing a joke for like three years. My premise was impossible pussy. Mm -hmm. Oh, like oh, a the vegan, Dave, like the, the Dave Chappelle yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah. See, I was doing this. I like I'm doing it for years. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And my thing, my joke is first of all, it's way more fun. Yeah. It's just fun. Right. You know what I mean? It's like my mm -hmm. the way I would do it, it'd be like, um, yeah. you know, this impossible pussy. And then I'd be like, there'd be testimonials. This ain't real pussy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like it's a taste test, mm -hmm. right? Anyways, it, the day he – that special dropped, I, my inbox was flooded. Mm -hmm. Okay? And I'm talking about from comics too. Like, legit yo, comics? dude. Legit comics? Yeah, yeah. You'd be surprised, yo, dude, man. What? Even though just telling me like, yo, dude, did he buy that from you? Or uh, did, wow. did, did, did he like – you know, and I was like, oh, no. And this has happened to me twice with Chappelle. Well, I've yeah. made a similar reference yeah. to him. And then I'd be like, well, there goes that. For me, I don't do the joke anymore. Well, you can't. If exactly. It, if it's him. Yeah. And he's so famous. Yeah. It's like, yeah, you he's know. he's bigger than you. No, he's no, super, you know, so yeah. it's like, I was like, God damn it, man. This is the second time this has happened. That sucks. You know, but, but I I don't fall in love with material. Yeah, that you can't, bro. You know, well, you just don't fall in love with material he, he, and I move yeah. on. It sucks, too, because there's the one thing, like, I don't I don't watch anybody stand up. I don't watch anybody stand up. For that reason? Nah, it's just like, it's not fun for me anymore. Like, I've seen, I, I, I like, I just don't watch it, bro. I don't watch. It's it. rare. And I so do. I watch Big J's. Mm -hmm. I watch Big J's special thing. Yeah, I, la I laugh my yeah. ass. Off. I think it's important to watch some of the, some of our dignitaries of uh, stand up for yeah. that for this well, reason. The last one I actually watched was the Chris Rock one, uh, not the new one. The whatever the last tambourine. One. Yeah, that you're one. saying like the 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 the, the tip big, of the spear guys. Yeah, man. I, sometimes I going. think it's important to like, especially yeah, if you yeah. have like, and I know some of these people. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So the thing is, is like like, you know, th this this has happened with Bill Burr. Mm -hmm. Same thing. Like you know, I saw I, he did a, something on Saturday Night Live that I was like. I was like, oh well, there goes that premise. Oh really? You know, so that, that's why I feel like it's especially like, if you're very prolific and you're and you're going to keep writing and you keep doing shit. Like, bro, I, like I have a new hour every year and a half. Like, you know, like that's a lot of material, and it's gonna you're, you're definitely going to be talking about the same shit that other people saying. talk about because the same shit's happening it's in the topical, world. Yeah, it's topical, topical yeah. or you know, it's like everyone's going to have something about Zoom. 
Do you know what I mean? Like in the past three years. Or pandemic, or, lockdowns. Yeah, or pandemic, exactly. But, but with, to your point, Eric, it's like not being married to the to the bit. It's like, you, I'll write a new one. It's all good. I'll come with yeah. more shit. That's what you, you have to feel like that. Yeah. Because, but also, too, though, but here's the thing. It's not even topical stuff that you have to understand. Like there will be examples of there, – there might be another guy – who just had two kids? Of course, yeah. Who has, a, you know, talking like, about like, kids, mm-hmm. dads, yeah, yeah. like yep. whatever, like like you have this. Speci- you think that this is my story. Yeah. And someone else is like, yeah, well, that's also my story. Yeah. I mean, I have, I have, <laughs> you know I have, I've like, had it. Gets it out first. I've had it both ways, where people are like, dude, you, this sounds like that, and then I've had people be like, dude, this guy's biting your shit, and it's like, yep. bro, I don't. When somebody tells me that somebody else is biting my shit, I don't even look at it, bro. Yeah. I don't I just, bro. I don't care. I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna. I'm not. I'm not taking any shit. I'm just gonna assume they're not. I don't give a fuck, dude. But also, the people that take, you're not gonna have a career. You get, especially in oh. today's age, you're gonna get found out. There's no way you can yeah, keep going up at the store and improv around other comics if you're known as that guy. You're fucked. When I was get- when I was very first starting, I had a a bit about fajitas. I've never oh, yeah, seen I've, I've never seen yeah. Nick Schwartz yeah, yeah. do any. I've yeah. never seen this stuff. Mm-hmm. And the fans would hit me up, mm-hmm. so I hit up Nick. I'm like, yo, I and I I was only doing the bit for maybe two or three weeks. Some hater came to the comedy store. I was like, oh, shop copy mm-hmm. Nick Schwartz. And I call up Nick. I'm like, hey, you have a fajita beat? Mm-hmm. He's like, yeah, but I saw yours. It's a little different. Oh, it's not a big deal. I was like, no, nah, I'm, I'm not. He was like, you can do it. I'm like, no, nah, I'm out, man. Yeah, that, it, yeah. There's hey, some, I can't. Your bit's so much better. Mine's so new, so I'd have to keep working on it. Also, I'm good, man. That's my, I just thought, my bad, I didn't know. Well, it's like, sometimes a comic is so big, prolific, like, it's like, no one can talk about Hot Pockets. Right, 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 nope. right, right. That's, and I, listen, I don't care how different. Yeah, 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 <laughs> it's yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Well, hot, hot hot if you use the words hot and pocket in a sentence. Jim Gavin. That's Jim Gavin. Hot, hot pockets. All day. He it's, it's, hot it's too specific of a thing. Like a lot of people will, a lot of people will do like the drunk girl stuff. I don't give a fuck about that. People are always like, dude, this guy's like, say, bro, that's such a wide topic, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know my shit went viral and people are going to compare your drunk bit maybe to mine. I, bro, that's so, when people say this guy's doing your drunk that that is that, that's, that's respect, a, Chris. What to me? That's respect. Like when people are like, dude, this guy's doing a version of your bit, your drunk girl bit, and that's one of the first times I met you. Your yeah. drunk girl bit was so prolific and good yeah. outside everybody else talking about drunk girls that whenever they see it, like hot pockets, mm-hmm. they think Chris D'Elia. Well, so when I hear well, that, I'm like, before that, they dope. were thinking, what's his face from Saturday? Night I, Live? Yes, dude, I know. Jim Brewer. Uh, 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 no, Jeff Richards had a funny uh, drunk girl character that he would do on yeah, snl yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. um and uh but yeah dude it's like it's such a big it, that's not like hot pockets drunk being drunk is it's Super like general. fucking having yeah. kids yeah. it's yeah. like you know it's so so like if somebody else is gonna come along and say hey my girl got drunk this happened people hit me up about that shit it's it's kind of annoying bro like it's such a big topic but the hot pockets thing as a comic so if, specific you know yeah. if you're not this is the other thing too <laughs> but this point. is the other thing too if if you're in the trenches doing a joke and talking about hot pockets and no comedian has been like yo bro you don't know about jim gaffigan shit and no comedian's been like yo jim gaffigan has that shit I mean that's you, that's not a real life. Yeah. Like you, you know what yeah, I mean? Like, I know, dude. Like that's that's in 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 some ways it's a responsible it's a responsibility for fucking other people to tell the person. Well, that's the reason why I'm telling you that I don't always agree with being like I don't ever want to watch comedy mm. because I find that when you I find that it's important to see what people are talking mm. about mm-hmm. and it keeps you. Um, sometimes you don't even realize things are in your head. It can you know? be inspiring too. Yeah, I know, but sometimes you just go. That's some, oftentimes I'll be like, oh, somebody has to have said this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. totally. <laughs> you know, right, you know right. what I mean? Yeah. So I'll be like, oh, maybe I should. You and know you know? and you won't even find out until you post it on the internet. You're like asking around, like, does somebody have a fucking thing? It seems too easy, and but it's funny, and oh, I got a dude. I had a comic. I won't even say his name. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We you know, know him. Yeah, you you know him. You know him. But he comes up to me at the comedy store after I go, and he goes, hey man, uh, you know I. People are gonna see you do your thing, and blah, blah, blah. and mm-hmm. I, I do the same kind yeah. of thing. And I go, and I said to him, I go, well, I actually did that on my special. <laughs> right, 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 right. <laughs> you know He's what all, I mean? Oh. I was like, and then it was just like, because because it, it was basically we were having a moment of like, who? who yeah, bro. It's survival of the yeah. fittest. Is it, like, let's see which goes, one's funny. It, it doesn't matter, man. Yeah. But I, but to, to to close this out. I, here's another comic that we all know. I'm uh-huh. not going to say the oh, person's yeah, course, name, yeah, but I remember I, this was way back in the Ha Ha days, mm-hmm. you know. And I, I, I was doing crowd work, mm. 
I was hosting a lot at that yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And some, something just came to me. Yeah, yeah. I'm do, boom, boom, boom. I'm doing. And then this person comes to me and goes, yo, kind of doing my stuff. You know? <laughs> you doing crowd work? <laughs> yeah. And I said, hey, listen, if off the top of my head, yeah. I'm just messing around. Yeah, yeah. You're, and you're, that's your material. You're terrible. You need to go back to the yeah. lab. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Okay? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Go back to the lab. I'm yeah. not, you, I'm not, if I can riff your yeah. material yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that you have written down. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Sorry. Sounds terrible. Yeah. Your material sounds terrible. Awful. You know? Yeah, 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 yeah. Chrisley.com. <laughs> so, but dude. Th- uh, God damn it, he can't stop plugging. You're selling it for him, dog. The NBA playoffs are here, and that means Big Hoops action with DraftKings Sportsbook and official Sportsbook partner of the NBA. Get in on the excitement of every game with a touch of a button. New customers can make a $5 pregame money line bet and score $150 in bonus bets if your team wins. Plus, everyone can score a no-sweat same-game parlay every day during the NBA playoffs. Open the DraftKings Sportsbook app, opt-in, place a same-game parlay on any NBA game. If it doesn't hit, you'll get a bonus bet back up to $10. So many good games My going on right now. My nuggets, bro, and no one's covering it. Yeah, the, the Nuggets, they're, they're, be, they're being slept on. But look, the Lakers are looking like they are a better team than people thought. You got Sacramento. They just beat the Warriors twice. So they're looking like they're a better Phoenix team than people thought. Phoenix is no thought. punk. Fe- and then well, the I e- think the Clippers yeah. are going to beat them. I'll take the Clippers. I agree. I'll take the Clippers. Huh? Huh? And then on the on the East, you got Who's Milwaukee. That? You got the Celtics. You got the Knicks. The no Bucks, punk. Yeah. Well, we already said it's going to be tough to beat the Bucks. the Bucks. You should be yeah, more specific. Yeah. All, All right, right, man. Let's go. That's it. Gambling uh, problem yep. call 1 800 Gambler in Massachusetts. Call 1 800 327 5050 or visit Gambling Helpline. Uh, what is that? M dot org. Mm. In New York, call 877 H O P E N Y. Gambling Helpline M A dot org. Oh, I didn't see that. Let's text Hope NY 467369. Right. In Kansas, call 1 800 522 4700 on behalf of Boot Hill Casino and Resort, Kansas City, 21 and over. In most eligible states, but age varies by jurisdiction. Eligibility restrictions apply. See DraftKings.com slash sportsbook for details and state specific responsible gambling resources. That's DraftKings Sportsbook with the code GOLDEN. $5 pregame money line bet and score $150 in bonus bets if your team wins. Only at DraftKings Sportsbook with the code GOLDEN. You guys ever browsed in incognito mode? <laughs> oh, you it's know we have. <laughs> probably not as incognito as you think. And why would it be? Incognito mode, like the Chrome browser itself, is a Google product. Hello? And Google has made its fortune by tracking your movements online. Oh, um, hell hello. no. There's even a $5 billion class action lawsuit against the company in California where it's accused of secretly collecting user data. Google's defense, incognito does not mean invisible. Wow, that's why uh, I use so duck, duck, duck. how do you actually make yourself invisible as possible online? You use ExpressVPN like we do. Mm-hmm. Yes, we sure do. You don't know where I'm doing my internet from. No. It could be in Calcutta, yeah. Jamaica. Right. ExpressVPN hides all of that. Uh. Every time you connect to ExpressVPN, you get a random IP address shared by many other ExpressVPN customers that make it harder for third parties to identify you or harvest your data. Best of all, ExpressVPN is super easy to use no matter what device you're on, phone, laptop, smart TV. All you have to do is tap one button for instant protection. Mm. So if you, are, if you really want to go incognito and protect your privacy, secure yourself with the number one rated VPN. Visit expressvpn.com slash golden and get three months, three extra months for free. That's expressvpn.com slash golden. Go to expressvpn.com slash golden to learn more. Stay golden. There's one, there's one comic that was, obviously I won't say him, but like he was like doing, he would do stuff in town and then he would go on the road and do a bunch of other comics uh, material. Like, because nobody knew because he was on the road. This was like before the internet was. Yeah. Made. Like, that's fucking crazy, bro. You, like, but you're not going to, you're going to get found out eventually. You're yeah, just, well. You're not going to have a career. Yeah. Well, now you're, but see, no, I disagree. I think you can have a career. But the, the, the this but will do numbies if we say names. So I don't know if you guys yeah, want to drop nah. numbies. <laughs> <laughs> see, that's a good producer. Always think about numbies. Who but are, are, but who also, are you talking about? But but also, <laughs> Eric, do you ever have, because you bring your uh, host and feature. Yeah. But when you book the local uh, talent, do they ever go, hey, is there any material you don't want me to touch on? I'm like, no, nah, man. Do your thing. Yeah, yeah. I, I never worry about that. Ever. Do your thing. Yeah. yeah. If it's um, better than mine, like, you know, cream rises at the top. Good for you, man. Yeah. Yeah, whatever, bro. I also, like, I want to. I want it to be hard for me to follow. Like, mm-hmm. I, I, you know, I think that some comics get big and then they're like, oh, uh, I, I want to chill sandbag and do my it. thing. What? They sandbag. 
Yeah, like well, they put up mean? shitty people in front. Oh of them, yeah, yeah. So they look sure, better. It's like happens. no, bro. It's the overall. We can definitely well, name some guys if, that do that. I don't know if that's the reason. I think that 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 may be the perception, but I think the reason is like you know, you know you're out here with your fans. You don't want to work that hard. Yeah, but that's kind of the same thing. Yeah, that'd no, be, that'd that'd be sandbagging. About, no, it's all about intentions, man. It's not. It's not to, like, to make yourself. It, as opposed to being like, I need to look like I'm the funniest. As oh, okay. opposed to being like, they're here oh, for me. Man, okay, yeah, now yeah, I got to yeah, go yeah, out yeah, here yeah, and yeah, fucking yeah, yeah, like yeah, do yeah, a yeah, whole sure, sure. do a One's whole a bit show. Ego based. Yeah. 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 So mm-hmm. I mean, I, I my things. I want the show to be great. So I overall, yeah. I just want them to. Yeah, me too. I want. By the time I get on, there's an energy flow, and then now I'm gonna ride this wave. You know what I mean? I always think I'm the funniest person in the room. Anyway. Yeah. I don't think I. I don't care who goes on stage. I don't care who goes on stage. Yeah. Before, you're good. Anybody. Yeah. There, no one's going to watch me after and be like, oh, I don't know if that guy belongs. No yeah. way. I don't give a fuck who but, it but, is. But that's the thing, though. <laughs> but, but, but that's the thing, though. Like, we have um, – I, I wouldn't say we have, like, similar styles, but, like, we're both animated and uh, high energy, you know. And, y- you know, to someone uh, – like, I remember when you fucking you, – I didn't want to follow you. I brought you – to the Irvine, whatever it was, mm-hmm. I didn't want to follow you. Improv? Yeah, I mean, you think I was fucking crushing, and I'm like, <laughs> but you know what? But I'm like, you know what? Some people, I, I, I actually hope some people are like, yeah, dude, we went to see Chris, but man, Eric fucking kill. Like, there are gonna be some. You, you're not gonna be the funniest guy in the room for everybody, right? No, you know, some people fuck and, with and, Eric, so, and that's yeah. why it's so dope when you have a tour. If you're going on tour, all of us going on tour, people are gonna like you. People are gonna like me. People are gonna like the other person. And those that's, tickets will be at christylea.com. Yeah. <laughs> but that's that's awesome, dude. Yeah. That's awesome. But the thing is, is like one thing you have to remember in that scenario, mm-hmm. like it's just like how you said it. It's so, I, okay. I remember, mm-hmm. remember the dude from Mad TV, Michael Mc, Michael McDonald. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. You, you know, so he started doing stand up. Yeah. You know, so the Irvine Improv, this back, back in the day, he called me and said, hey, can you come do this show mm-hmm. with him, you know? Mm-hmm. And so, like, he just started. So he was, you know, yeah. whatever, right? Yeah. And this girl came up to me after the show, and she was like, oh, my God, you're so much funnier, blah, 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 right? right. And I said, thank you, but if that said Eric Griffin, would you have come? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So so yeah. all that, and, and just how you just said that, that's the sentence what people will say. It doesn't matter. They would say, we went to go see Chris D'Elia. Yeah. And the opener was good. It, they wouldn't the, say Eric Griffin. What's the important part there? Yeah, we went to go right, right, see. Right, right. I think the that's the only thing that's important. No, I think the narrative's changing because you know I do the I meet greets. So. I on you it is. <laughs> I get. It, I'm, t- I'm telling you, I I see it in the f- on the yeah, ground. For you now level. you're not just an I'm, opener. No, well, I know, no, we know right. that. No, yeah. I'm saying I'll, every single city I go to, mm-hmm. people will either go. Eric was here before. Or I saw Eric. Yeah. Like he's so yeah, yeah, yeah. funny. I'm like. Yeah, he's a monster. Like, why I know, is he bigger? I'm like, he's getting it. I know the problem is, is that's the thing. It's like there, there, there's a difference between being like, like you can like put on a good potato. show and then it's like, how do you get people to get to yeah, the yeah, show? Yeah, it's a different thing. I come from a different era, uh, sadly, where it's like, you know, I, I missed some of this. Mm. So it's like I'm now I'm trying to catch up mm. and getting to people. Come watch me perform because you won't be disappointed. No way. You know? That's See, but thing. I would rather have that, Eric. I'd rather be in your position where – once the crowd's there, you have the chops to do it. Yeah. Where they're never gonna leave. You know what I'm saying? Then some some of these like YouTubers, other people, where it's instant sellout, and then they they only have a career for two or three yeah, years. Yes, the curiosity. Once they come person. to your show, they're yeah. always coming, Eric, because yeah. you're so come talented. On, Eric <laughs> um, but yeah, so. Anyway, that was speaking of watching me. I'm going to be at the Louisville that. Comedy Club. Uh, when did this come out? This Thursday? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you, you might probably you, Friday, Saturday. Come they check could me use out. some laughter up there. Yeah, and then the mothership yeah, next weekend. Um, oh yeah, yeah. I want to know how that goes. Uh, I'll be at uh, let's see, uh, Pueblo, Colorado. Right? Is that what it's called? Pueblo. Yeah. Tucson. A lot of biker gangs up there. A lot yeah. Of meth. Be good for you. Tucson, right in. Ohio. I'll be in Ohio. Wow, his internet's not working. That's amazing. I'll be in Ohio. I'll be in. Uh, Let's upgrade these pictures, huh? Cleveland, Tucson. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he looks sad there. Um, Charlotte, Knoxville, Little Rock. Look at all this. Nashville, Calgary. I'm doing Canada, Montreal. Oh, you're into September already. Yeah, uh, Detroit, Orlando. You want to give your 2025 20, dates too, or Fort Myers? <laughs> Well, that's what people are doing now, far, though. You know, I know. Yeah, okay. uh, <laughs> yeah, but that's the thing, though, because you'll keep selling. I'll keep selling however many tickets a day up in, until it happens. In 2031, I'll be at the uh, amphitheater. <laughs> in- <laughs> but you keep selling tickets till the fucking thing comes up. Yeah, I feel you. So it's like, 
I'm at La, uh, La Jolla Comedy Store, I think, first week of June. I'm there, and then June 13th through the 25th, might be the 15th through the 25th. 15th through the 25th, I'm in UK, Belfast, Europe, yeah. Dublin. I'm all over. Yeah. One theater run, one show not in every city. So come get you something. Damn. The Comedy Store La Jolla, first week of June. That's a great club. Um, oh, um, the La Jolla favorite. one? My favorite. Yeah. I never liked it. Uh, Why? You, you gay. I never liked it. Everyone would, all the comics would talk about how great the La Jolla Comedy Store is. And I just, everyone was always entitled, drunk, in the audience, super white. It just was too, I, I, well, you're like a mix, you know? Isn't that your crowd? <laughs> I mean, it's mostly white. Yeah. But in La Jolla, Got him. <laughs> but, in, but in La Jolla, it's only white. I think he meant the entitled part, too. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Do you not yeah. know your crowd? Are you the head of marketing for Bud Light? <laughs> no, but um, that's so dumb. What? I mean, it's just what's dumb about it is in so, your eyes. They're down seven billion dollars. Are they? <laughs> yeah. Really? Oh, dude. So what? Whoa. Really? Are they actually, or is this a Brendan Schaub thing you just said? Yeah, bring yeah, it up, Nick. Bring it back. up, Nick. <laughs> bring it up. See how, see, how, see how much money they've lost. Don't go to that. Go go to the article. Yeah, I don't Whoa. think it's real. They lost. But, well, I'm losing. I'm, if you say they lost money, okay, but that's a lot of money. It was the price when you calculate the stock price drop in a couple of days. They did lose whatever, how much? It was six million. Anheuser Bush. You, you said six what? Six billion. Billion? Yes. So no, if you keep going down, no way. Yeah, keep going down. Well, because we don't know how to read. Even those. if that's there, you go half wrong. Even if that's double wrong, three billion. You know what I mean? Despite the controversy, the company's stock is still sitting at a 52-week high and is outperforming competitors. So that's okay, the, let's move on. Legit the opposite of <laughs> no, what you no, said. No, you got to go. I'm telling you, Nick. Type in the right shit. Um, it, it dropped 3% following the news of the thing. If you okay. look at the last that, that year, was when it's it, up 52%. That, that's it, when, it, it, it. When, okay. when that so it came out, drop. they dropped. So yes, it did drop. 100%. Okay. Okay. Um, that is... Uh, well, yeah, that's I, where is it now, though? Well, if it, I mean, it's, it's keep you know, it's going up and up and up and up, but after that came out, it went down. Um, whatever, uh, I don't care, honestly. <laughs> yeah. I, I didn't drink, I didn't drink Bud Light anyway. I don't, right, I don't really right, give right. a fuck. I think they're way off in trying to yeah, well, virtual signal to it's, a it's, small yeah, demographic, yeah, 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 yeah. but it's also like, no, your demo, dude. Yeah, you're Bud, drinking Light. Fucking Bud Light, it's Bud Light, yeah, it's not fucking I sweet. Even, I don't even think that has anything to do with anything at all. Their I demo? Think, I think it has to do with like, they're like, how many followers that person have? 10 million? Maybe we can get these people to drink our drink too. And they just did that. Not even, th it's mm -hmm. like, it's like as if you're at the store and you're, and you're, and you're, let's say you're at the market and you got mm -hmm. your cart, you know, and you see a transgender person mm -hmm. in a cart before mm -hmm. you and they get fruit, fruity pebbles. Yeah. And you, are you going to be like, well, I'm not going to eat that now. Yeah, correct. That's stupid. No, that's so stupid. They're no, already called <laughs> fruity pebbles. I know, yeah, I'm just yeah. saying. What I'm saying is like that's basically what they're saying is like I'm not going to drink. Any, they they think that they think that Bud Light cares about agenda. No, they care about selling Money, Bud Light. Yeah. And this person has 10 million followers. It's a demographic that they haven't got mm -hmm. to yet. So they were just thinking, hey, let's just go into this demographic. Mm -hmm. I, bet I, I, I bet you they need to drink all the hate they're getting. Yeah. They probably need to take it. You yeah. know, hey, if you, are, you being, are you being hated on by the Christian right? Yeah. Yeah. You know what you need? A Bud Light. Yeah. You know I, I, mean? I literally don't give a just, fuck. You're just holding your dick I literally and your don't. tits at the same time. And you're like, <clears throat> you know what I mean? Cause it's like, <laughs> it's just stupid. No. I'm just saying, you're a, listen, you're fucking stupid. Who? These people that are shooting Bud Light, oh, like, well, Kid, like Kid Rock? What yeah. the fuck is wrong with that, that guy? Dumb, they're, too, they're, too, they're, well, they're too far on that's their dumb. team. Where it goes against their yeah. agenda, they're too far on that team. It's like, yeah. bro, bro. That, that, it's not the well, Bud they, Light. But that's, but that's who follows that guy. There's a lot of people who do that. That's how he's making money. But when I'm, that's what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, he's so, all making So all here's, my, here's my here's my Him point. Him and Sierra are best friends. <coughs> I'm sorry, what'd you say? <laughs> this is what I'm saying is that fringe agenda mm -hmm. is equivalent to the opposite agenda correct you you are you are just this is just this is they're the all transgender crazy. whatever you yeah. want to call yeah. it. this is the same shit but they're all you're crazy too far on one side you're crazy, crazy. you're, you're crazy. wrong <laughs> yeah. 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 let me tell you something let me tell you something this this dylan what's what's the Mulvaney. person name? Is it, is, is, and, and, and he's saying is it she or he i don't know was a guy now is she okay so that person it's mentally ill. Look at the person. It has nothing to do with because of the trans thing. Anybody who's like, well, we are, why? If it's a yeah. chick, you're crazy. No. If you're a dude, you're crazy. <laughs> it doesn't matter if you have a dick or a pussy. 
that person's crazy because look at them. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm tired of this bullshit where people are like, Agreed. oh, they're insane because tra trans people are watching that shit. Real trans people watch that shit. They go like this. <laughs> Here we go again. Yeah. Well, they, they think that Mulvaney got, too, like he was trying to get into act and couldn't do it. Then his friend wrote him this part where he had to dress as a girl. So, you know, it's like, did he do it because he actually feels like a woman or did he do it to gain, you know, attention yeah, the, the in Hollywood? Per, the person like, has a lot of pu there's a lot of pushback on that yeah. person well, because of the different, like, but, but I, also, get, I don't know the get ins, yours, girl. I don't know yeah. the ins and outs of it. I don't know about this friend. I don't know what's going on in that person's head. What I do know is that person cries every day yeah. every day about some shit yep that's bad you can tell the people who cry every day look at their faces yeah look at their fucking faces super dehydrated when you see two people beefing online and one person's a piece of shit and the other person's a piece of shit look at them look at their picture you can tell a lot of tears who's the nut job yeah and who's wrong you can tell and in this case this is the same thing on both sides Oh yeah, well, like, those, bro, like, bro. like those, these two need to get together He's and have a Bud Light. Ill. That's what I'm saying. He's <laughs> mentally ill. <laughs> yeah. That's to put it. all the Bud Lights on the thing, shoot him with an AK-47. That's a mentally ill yeah. thing. Or, to do. or he's just bored as shit. Yeah, he could be just rich and fucking. He, how, how he about does the cruises. One idiot, the one idiot that's also like that 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 set the Jack Daniels on fire. Mm -hmm. So we're not oh, talking about Jack. Like now, now you're just now you're just being weird. Yeah. Jack, why, why, why are you dragging oh. Jack into it? Because yeah, yeah. I think they put a bottle with like a rainbow on it. Guys, like, enough's uh, enough. Yeah. Oh, they had a RuPaul like thing where they promoted Jack Daniels. I think it happened a long time ago, but it just got rediscovered yeah, again. Yeah. Oh, that's someone just wait and be like, and look at this. These guys are out there like, I've been drinking cum this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. You know I, mean? I knew I was in gay. It's this Jack goddamn. Jack off Daniels. <laughs> that's what I think it is. <laughs> that's why these thoughts are in my head secretly. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I told you, Dave, I ain't gay. Any, I believe, yeah. I, any, <laughs> we should make that product jack off <laughs> Daniels. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, dude, it's. Uh, we started the show? What is that? What you got for us, Nick? Well, yeah. Well, nah, let's get, fuck it. What, yeah. Is this the Patreon one or the regular one? This is regular. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Didn't. <laughs> Wait, that, co hey, congrats yeah, on the I baby, man. Say, I was congrats bring up on the see, fucking crazy baby. Bring up now, but yeah, I'm, 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 yeah, I got two kids now, bro. It's wow. so weird. Welcome to the party. Yeah, I know, right? It's the best. To say, to, it's so weird to. It feels so weird to say, I have kids. Mm -hmm. it's, it's like, how did it's, I get it's, here? It's, it's like having a kid is well. First of all, having a kid is a huge thing in your life that changes you and your thoughts. If you're a good person, yeah. If you're, yeah. Well, continue the other way too, mm -hmm. but um, but then when you say now, now it's like I have kids, that really makes me feel like an adult. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, like finally. Yeah, <laughs> for real. Yeah. You know, I was thinking about this man. Like, so no more sneakers. Yeah. Let's yeah, get yeah. some. Uh... Our outfits beg to differ. <laughs> yeah, the barbershop ones. Yeah, I love the those. barbershop <laughs> dunks. Um, but yeah, I I um, I meant ones as in these are the ones that I have not I know they're not ones people will be like they're not ones so uh yes I it I because the job that we have bro I was talking about this with another comic who's 50 something it's not Brian Callen but we were talking Brian's about like 60 but yeah. no it will go for Brian but yeah. Brian like he looks fantastic I know we always were talking about the about the uh um, how old he his looks age and yeah, shit yeah. but like dude we live a life of doing what we love you know, and we're so uh, silly. That shit keeps us young, bro. Yeah, and 100%. in a good way. And then also in like a, a way where it's like, yeah, you know, like sometimes I, I leave my up. underwear in the yeah. living room. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm like, and I'm like, man, my dad would have never done that. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. But like, yeah. but like I'm, f and then, and then in my head, I'm like, I mean, I'm only 43, but like, that's fucking old, <laughs> yeah. you know? So, yeah. <laughs> it is. but like, like it keep like that, that mindset is good, but it's also like, you know, well, Chris, I've got two kids now. Congratulations. Thank you. And uh, Chris sent us a picture mm -hmm. and. <laughs> This boy, half the picture was balls. Okay, okay. I know. Not mine. I didn't. Like the kid's balls. I didn't know. And then Eric goes on the on the group text, goes, holy balls. And, Eric go, and Chris goes, oh, man, I didn't see his balls. I it's it's just this thick nutsack. I'm so in love. 
with I'm just taking pictures, sending, and then it, it and looked then like he was one of those, one of those bouncy things. Yeah, you know? It looked like he, <laughs> I, I thought the same thing. <laughs> or, 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 no, it looked like it was, like a, it was a beehive, just this yeah, big dude. nutsack. Yeah. The, when when a, a male is born, there's a lot of fluid in there. I didn't know that. Uh, um, and I kept mine. I still have mine. The fluid. <laughs> Yeah, it's I, in like a jar. Yeah, I bring it to the. Gym. You should make necklaces, <laughs> you know, like like Angelina Jolie. Yeah, yeah. with the blood. <laughs> this Chris Delia ball, ball juice. This is his balls juice. You got Chris Delia like Chris Delia Yeah, yeah. Dude, com. I, I've had two boys. Com. I've never seen a pair of balls like that. Yeah, well, them boys, are, they, they were like that. Crazy. I don't know if Calvin's were, were like that, but they nuts, said that. Right. Yeah, it's gone now. I mean, it it goes away. Oh, they're tiny, but now. No. They're not tiny, okay? <laughs> he has big balls. Oh, do you uh, <laughs> decide on the name? That fight. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What? Do you decide on the name? Yeah, William. William McHenry. Um, my dad's name. My, Bill. You know, my dad. And yeah. then uh, McHenry is her, uh, on her mom's side, is her maiden name. So, or her name, her last name. So that's the middle name for him? Yes. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, really cool. I fucking, it's awesome, dude. It's wild. It's so, <laughs> forget, you forget how small they are. Yeah. yeah. Bro. Newborns are weird. <laughs> They're and they all—they do look like old men. None of them look good. Everyone's like, "He's so yeah, cute." You had it's that like picture. Yeah, I was like, "Well, here's another serious kid coming out of between you." Old, yeah. I mean, Calvin you know I mean? is focused. This kid is like, "Nah." Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Calvin is like, "What's going on?" Yeah. This, this kid, I skeptical thought, hippo. This kid is like, "What are you trying to tell me?" Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He very well. I saw that one picture. He was like, he had a look on his face, like, "Why am I out of my apartment?" Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine, what, think about what it's like. Think about what it's like to be born. Actually, that must be traumatizing. Like for real. Like we don't remember it. Horrible. But yeah. like, you're you're chilling. Oh, it's awesome. You're upside down. You don't Yank. even know it. I'll tell you different. No. You don't even know it. You're upside down. You don't give a fuck. You're like, man, this is cozy, warm as fuck, chill. And then all of a sudden, then like all the lights. Yeah. Then nine people. Then you have to also breathe now. <gasps> like weird as fuck. Yeah. That's why they cried because that is painful. Yeah. And, and and how's Calvin doing with it, dude? Did people tell you like the advice on how to do it with the kid people with, were with like, older brother? Yeah, they did. Like maybe like he like it's he's responsible. Like we're the, the the you know it's your brother. They, they say they say say it's his baby too. Yes, correct. You know? But um, so everyone's like he's gonna be jealous. Be, be ready. And mm -hmm. I know Calvin. I know he's not gonna be jealous. I know this boy. And and sure enough, he was just like so trepidatious around him it's like do you want to hold him he's like no he's like worried that he's going to do something hurt like him, yeah. yeah hurt him it's really sweet and then the other day I, I heard him with Kristen and he they were looking at William and he was like does he like me it was the sweetest fucking yeah. thing dude that when the baby came out we handed so obviously my mm -hmm. wife held him but then the, but next to her mm -hmm. it was Tiger we're like, that's Aww. your brother. That's your baby brother. Yeah. Now he's like super protective. Aww. Yeah. It's so sweet man. Um, that's what you need. Yeah, it's the I best. Know. All right, Nick, what do you got? The kidless section over there. What do you got? <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of kidless. Uh, is it Johnny Sanchez? <laughs> Johnny Sanchez and Rock of Ages. What up, Golden Hour? It's Vintage Mike here, coming at you with a debate club. So I recently saw that the baseball player, Anthony Bass, was uh, his wife was on a flight with her five-year-old and two-year-old kids. They were eating some popcorn on there, and they made a bit of a mess. Uh, the flight attendant made the baseball player's wife pick up all the popcorn, uh, quote unquote, on their hands and knees. So Anthony was upset about that and put me to a Twitter post where it seemed like he was getting kind of roasted on. That couldn't go uh, So it got me thinking, what do you guys think? Um, the bait club, who do you think was in the wrong? The baseball player, his wife, or the flight attendant? What do you guys think? Hold on. So let me read what they actually said. Go up. Traveling with a five-year-old and two-year-old to get on her hands and knees to pick up the popcorn and mess by young children. What? Well, where you at on this? I'll tell you right now, my, my kids wouldn't make that mess. No, you have to pick it up. 100%. You can't. Uh, I would clean it up. You yeah, can't and it's like you expect your, the flight, poor I, flight attendant to pick up after your kids and it's all over the aisles. As soon as one colonel drops, I'm like, I'd ask my kid, I'm like, what are you doing? This is just some entitled rich people bullshit. But wait, was he on the flight? He was not. Was okay, I'm like, I mean, he was on the flight. Like, what are you doing? <laughs> my wife had to do yeah. it. <laughs> Yeah, where was he? <laughs> I can't believe I had to watch my fucking five-month pregnant wife. I had to order her to do it. Um, He's just filming it. This is ridiculous. Baby, uh, this miss is, the spot. Uh, to me, this is crazy. Not only just... I don't even mean it's crazy to actually be that entitled. I think it's crazy to post about it. Like, bro, to be that unaware 
is nuts. Thank you for everyone's support. Oh, that it, go, go down a second. Care of matter, go, taking oh, care oh, of the sorry. matters of the flight attendant oh, shit. internally. Right there, though. So, so he's basically trying to get her fired. This one is important. My last count, incident, United provided the popcorn. Yeah, but you have to know your kids don't know how to eat popcorn. Yeah, but but also you your wife allowed them to have that popcorn. They okayed it. It's not like the flight attendant was like just randomly handing them bullshit that they can't have. I don't bro, behind your back. Like fuck. the wife asks goes, "Yeah, the, this whole thing is I'm with you dude, on this." Stop snitching, you motherfucker. Yeah. Dude, pick up the back of the popcorn <clears throat> to get this poor lady fired, bro. <laughs> this motherfucker this because this guy knows how to play baseball. Dude, if he didn't know how to play baseball, he's this motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Fuck this motherfucker. I mean, he's probably a nice guy. I have no fucking idea. I have no idea. I'm sure he's probably but, a but you know what? Guy well, he needs to remove the Christian part because. But you know, know what? He But also, he wasn't there. He wasn't there. So remember, his wife called him. Probably oh, super dramatic. Good point, dude. Oh, and then he was like, good. oh, hold on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then he was like, oh, hell no. And got on Twitter. I was on my good. hands and knees. What a good point, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This guy. Bitches be crazy. Uh, this guy, it, it's. Yes, it's all her fault. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, one for the men. <laughs> Fuck yeah, bro. I'm back on your side. And not only that, I'm a fucking huge Toronto Blue Jays fan now. <laughs> yeah, I like this guy. Fuck yeah, dude. I'm and he probably, he probably tweeted that you know, to support his wife. She's like, you better do something. Yeah, oh, dude. This guy. And then he's like, oh, shit, this yep. did not go well. Yep. Yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. Lo dude, the best... Could fucking Toronto players is Joe Carter, man. Well, he has to. Oh, good poll. He has to do John that. Alred. I mean, honestly, John if Alred. you think about it, he has to do that. What do you mean? You know, it's like his, his wife calls, you know. Because, like, because, no. you know, like, behind the scenes, you know, in your mind, you'd be like, were you on your hands and knees? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. You know oh, what I mean? Yes. Were you on your hands and knees? Yeah. Like, I'm just thinking if it was Rachel, I'd be like, were you on your hands yeah, and knees? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, should you have gotten them home hard? Both knees you or one I mean? knee. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, and yeah. you're kind of like, was it a big mess? You know. Oh, like, I would have done but this. But then she's like, "You support me. I am carrying your oh, child." I would have let her go off. I'm like, "Uh huh, that's crazy. Damn, yeah. that's crazy." But uh, you land when? I wouldn't yeah, give yeah, a fuck. Yeah, you, yeah. Are you landing? So, okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. Click. Babe, aren't you gonna take care of it? Yeah, yeah. Look, I'll call United. Click. Yeah. yeah. Not calling United. Yeah, I talked to them. They're gonna talk Not to you. Not calling United. Not calling them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah I'll get on. Tell it. Sweetie, Click. I called them. They're gonna take care of it. Yeah. Don't apparently, they're gonna fire. All right. Uh, you land soon? From the childless section. How pregnant <laughs> is 22 weeks? Because I feel like that's not that pregnant. She's, not, she's, not, she's halfway. showing a little bit, but yeah. Wow. Halfway. halfway. No, but, but she could be having a fucking horrible time in that pregnancy. You don't know. Yeah. I mean, being pregnant is different, bro. <laughs> yeah. about, man, the first fucking, <laughs> the first trimester of this last pregnancy, yo, hey, nobody talks about how terrible it is for the guy. <laughs> <laughs> never. Oh, no, you can't. You can't. Go on. They'll this. kill you. They will go, kill Chris. You for this. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna say, go, Chris. Bro. I'm gonna teach you something right now. Yeah. Pregnancy for the man is so you can learn that when you're tired, when you're upset, when you have things going on, you still gotta get shit done. No one. Gives a fuck. Yeah, yes. dude. Yeah, that's yeah. what it trains you for. Yeah, that yep. point is to train you for it. So, so, like you know, it's like it's like it's just yeah, that's all that is. And what was your wife really Completely. sick? Like she the first trimester, yeah, no, super she, sick. I'm, I'm joking, but she was very sick, very depressed. It was fucking. It was fucked up. It was really hard to deal with for her and me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and, it's, it, the yeah. worst. Yeah, yeah. He, nobody gives a fuck. Was, dude, it was no one gives a fuck. Tell you. No one gives a no fuck. One yeah, 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 yeah. Cares. I know, I know. And I want it. And I want you know. And look, we have two, we have two boys. We knew it was gonna be a boy. You know, we want to have a girl too. And uh, we'll have three or four kids. I don't know. The first trimester of that, uh, this second one, I, I was fuck like, more kids, oh, yeah. Charge it to the game, dude. We yep. can't have another kid. <laughs> but then you forget because of these. But then you forget. Well, no, two years well, goes yes, by. That like, is yeah, true. And that's biological. It. That's yeah. biological because yeah. you need to fucking keep procreating. Mm -hmm. But the after the three month mark, that shit was, oh, it was so much better, bro. I mean, it was like a few days later, like after the three months mark. Dude, she was just like it was like I'm walking on sunshine. Oh, until 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 eight and a half months, and she's just like, oh, she's not gonna move. She's not gonna move. She can't, bro. How? Imagine having a fucking just a thing hanging off. She she went to bend over once, and I'm just like I'm I'm like imagine what that must feel like to have not only the seven pounds of baby or eight pounds of baby, but to also have you got to have your fucking your tits all fucking just <laughs> just fucking. Just so big, yeah. and you're just like, and all the fat and the placenta, and you're just, and she went to bend over to pick it up, and I'm like, 
damn, that's fucking rough. And then I dip my chips in the guacamole and ate it. <laughs> Even though she probably farted. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I go, damn, that's rough. <laughs> Didn't do shit. Mm. Just like that no. baseball ball. No, no, no. I go, sweetie, let me pick that up. Sweetie, let me pick that up. Oh, oh too late. No, it, no, I'm kidding. But yeah, dude, it's I, that's man. They're all they're all different looking. Did she have it's cravings? Hard. Did she have terrible cravings? No, nah, she had. Um, yeah, I mean, like just like like fruit and shit, like mm. not like weird. Uh, I'm, I'm that's all. That's t. That, I feel like that's TV pregnancy. What do you mean? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. No, oh. there, no, there's cravings. No, my no, there my, are, girl, there my girl, are, like no. flaming hot Cheetos. Like you wouldn't believe. Now my son fucking loves them. I'm there, like, there are do cravings. You need something else, maybe. But the, the talk about the TV shit. I always thought that um, TV pregnancy, when their water breaks, it's always like, oh, no, you know what yeah. I mean? Uh-oh. They're sliding down to the doctor's <laughs> office. But <laughs> it's a slip it's and slide. slide. <laughs> <laughs> fucking, just fucking, Doosh, here we go. <laughs> you on the back? <laughs> She's coming in, doc. Just <laughs> and... Uh, <laughs> And and I'm like, well, that's not how it happens, you know. It, pro- it leaks out, whatever. Like even Cal didn't have it, dude. This time, holy shit, Gushers? We, we went into the hospital to induce. So you know, it wasn't. We weren't waiting for the water to break, but we were. So we get into the hospital. They put the they they got some, they do so much to it. They do so much Too to much. get this shit ready. They're like, let's put the pill in. Let's put the balloon in. We got the Wi-Fi going. Like it's just insane. They put right? the epidermal in her back. The needles yep, like yep, this big yep. touches her fucking spine. Epidural, not yep. epidermal, but yes. Uh, and uh, epidermal would be on the skin. Dermal, right? Oh, so it's okay. No, mine was just on the skin, though. <laughs> <laughs> mine, no. mine was just on the skin. Yeah, it was just the skin. That's why I said epidermal. You did it, too. Do yeah. me, too. Yeah. And um, that makes your legs numb anyway. Yes. But the uh, – so, dude, she go, she's laying on her side, and I'm there chilling, you know, and she's, got, and she's looking at TikTok or whatever the fuck on her phone, and all of a sudden she goes, oh, my. And I said, what? I'm a scared, you know? I think like a hand's coming out. Also, you're a housewife from out. the 50s? Oh, oh dude, my. No, you know what I said on my podcast? I said it was like a fucking old lady that saw some dope bougainvilleas. Just like, oh, my. <laughs> like, and, and, she, uh, and I said, what? And she says, my water broke. And I pull back the thing. Dude. I, Bren- I, I, Brendan's fish tank was there. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, dude, three air ones. It, they, I was like, oh, they gotta. We have to move rooms. Like they have to change. They, they, they have to change. They gotta the move sheets. rooms. I mean, it was. It was like they they put sheets down in case that happens. It was well over that and onto the bed. And I'm like, oh, I gotta get a different bed. Like, and they came in there. And it was so. What's funny. a nine pound sack carrying the fucking yeah. kid? Whatever, bro. Think the nurse it. came in and I was, and we were like, is that normal? And the nurse goes like this. Yeah, and I was like, "It's not." Oh, oh no. no! It was so much a movie thing. Dude. Oh it was no! Insane. Yeah, and she and she didn't even know how to lie to you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but getting back to it, yeah, this guy, we get what, why you did it, but you shouldn't have done it that way. Tweeting about it like that, that's just. But also, he, he had pressure from the wife. That's all. We you, also understand. No, you know what? You just never know what people are going through, dude. That lady shouldn't get fired. You shouldn't fucking shame this guy. The guy gets it. He tweets it out. I'm sure he feels like a fucking dick. But also bit. that mom who's pregnant flying with two kids. You ever flown ju- with the kids by yourself? It's oh. a fucking beast, dude. I'm you sure. got snacks. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure they're good. You can't ever chill. Sleep. Mm-hmm. There's no sleeping. With two kids, yeah. It's a beast, dude. That's why you, that's why you shouldn't fly. With you, kids? With Wait till you have kids, though. Right, right. Wait, I understand you, that, you get these little bitches. You have to. You yeah. have kids. You have to take them to Hawaii and shit. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> have grandma come. To you. Yeah. No oh, damn, <laughs> yeah. my bad player. Is this a little Browse? Yeah, that's Browse. What's up? Hey, he, him and Chim were in Atlanta. <coughs> what up, boys? What's up, boys? That's Welcome Austin, to too. Golden Hour. <laughs> we just saw Brendan perform at the punchline. We're in Atlanta, and we have a Am no, I Wrong jump for off. that? <laughs> Samples. Yeah, so ba- <laughs> he said they got a Am I Wrong for that? <laughs> wrong for that. <sighs> samples. Yeah, so basically... Getting samples or multiple samples from a spot when you know for a fact you're not going to eat not there, gonna you get just it. wanted the oh, snack. Yeah, you're not going to buy what they're selling, you're just hungry. Whole yeah. Foods, the mall. Yeah, selling them a dream that you're going to be a customer, but Costco. I know you're not. Am I wrong for that? I mean, you're wrong for that romantic mean, sunset. What the fuck is this, bro? <laughs> it it, it fades that? over there making out, you know what I mean? <laughs> Here's some bent over on the fucking. His fades over and they're just like, oh, ah. yeah, yeah. Dude, 
why are stroking them? Yeah, give me the, the jack off Daniels. Can you give me some? <laughs> why did they do the fucking superimposed? It's beautiful. I, 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 kind of, there's a parking lot. I yeah. asked him for this shot. Oh, that's funny. Because right, cool. this, the sun was setting. And isn't beautiful. that where you performed? Right oh, there. is it? Yeah, yeah, close there, yeah. In the parking lot? Yeah. <laughs> was it a Burt Kreischer show with the cars and shit? Remember we were doing all this? Um, that's fucked up. If you need to do that, though, because you're hungry, fucking... I did it. in high school and in college because you don't have a ton of money, so I'd go by the Chick-fil-A thing a few times. And finally, that bitch like, uh-uh, keep going. No, I mean, here. if I'm working at the place and I know some, like, buddy's hungry... I would just be like, ah, oh, fucking. The ice cream but people. But trying to get one over on me, get the fuck out. The ice cream people. <laughs> the ice cream people are the worst. When you're, you know, you've been there a million fucking times. Like, no, mm, can I try it. vanilla? I'm like, bitch, you know what vanilla tastes this, like. This is the, I'm trying to get in and out. You stupid it's cut. Not even, no, no. Here's the thing. I got that right. shit. Is, bro. How's the chocolate? You, all? Hey, you know how it is. That's I give them one of those when I, I worked there. You know how it is. You know how it is. If it's a mystery <laughs> flavor, I get try it. it. Don't, don't offer samples. That. I, I don't even get that. No. The you mystery flavor of it's like a popcorn, right? Flavor? No, don't You don't get that. You You're right. don't get that kind. You're right. No, no. Here's the thing. If you're walking in a supermarket and you think, oh, let me try that. Because you know, they're going like, hey, would you like to try yeah. some like, you know. Never. Turkey, duck, meatballs. And you're like, all right, Never. that's not interesting. When it becomes a problem is when like you circle back and you're like, oh, can I try another <laughs> That's when you go yeah. too far. You get one sample. You get one sample. Yeah, did you like it? But it's not like you walk up to, like, if you walk, if you see, oh, there's the sample people. I'm, you know, let me go, let me go check this out. And you're there, like, oh, yeah, that looks, you know, what, you know yeah, how, but how, you, you know. know people do that. Costco, right. Costco used to do it and it'd be like, oh, you want to try this, whatever, Flaming Young? Like, fuck yeah, bitch. <laughs> Glad you said that. Yeah, if fuck yeah, bitch. <laughs> it's a chick. If you're, oh, if, you're thr if you're trying things at Costco, like, you got other problems. Yeah. yeah. I, I, I was younger, man. I think, <laughs> I, I mean, look, if you go into an ice cream place and you try two different samples, that's okay. No, fuck you. You think so? It's I'm ice, trying to be it's lenient. It's ice cream. No, dumbass. I disagree. It's ice you cream. You think more. No, I think I disagree. Where you do it is at the yogurt place. You know? It's yogurt. Well, what's the difference? No, because yogurt, yogurt's a dumb thing. So they have yep. to have ridiculous, you know. Blackberry sage, blah, blah. And you're like, okay, can I check that out? And then you taste it and you go like, oh, this doesn't taste like what it's supposed to taste like. So you go, mm, I don't know if I want that one. Let me try. Okay. That's why you're trying a couple different flavors. No, bitch. But if it's like chocolate, strawberry, vanilla. Well, of course. Then you're like, go fuck yourself. But I mean, it's never that. It's like peanut butter corn or whatever. <laughs> <dump. laughs> Pepto bismol. Well, well, like that. Right. Yeah, they, it's like you see that and you go, "I gotta try that." Well, that's, that salt and straw off <laughs> Abbott. Salt and straw off Abbott Kenny has those weird, like bone marrow cherry that's whiskey. That's what I'm saying. No, no, bitch. You buy it and no, then you gotta deal you with it. Try it out. Oh, that's why they had the little cops. No, nah, that's some hoe shit. You, 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 you. That's that samples is. are for hoes. Yeah, I agree, bro. Samples are for hoes. Samples Make are a for decision hoes. and you Fuck live with yeah, it. Dude, if it's it bad, out. don't buy it next time you come through, well, you not, fucking all idiot. All I have to say is, I got who. Yeah, <laughs> yeah you look like, he looks like a sample. <laughs> yeah, 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 I sample. Yo, you sample. Fuck you you. It'd be sampling. Be sampling. <laughs> yeah, it'd be sampling. <laughs> and another one. <laughs> this Hell fucking yeah. dude is uh, DJ Khaled yeah. in the sample. Another one. Yeah, like that sweet corn waffle cone. Honey, marshmallow, Rocky Road. I got to check that out. Look at this. Strawberry cilantro. Yeah, check it out by Get purchasing a scoop, here. dude. That's why you got to try it. Black, Black olive. Oh, jeez. Not burn it. Out of here. Is this, what's it called? Salt and straw. They have some good shit, but that? <laughs> come on. You got to try that. The, the, the best is afters. Yeah, you got to try it. Afters yeah, is the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah you got to try it, you <laughs> fucking hoe. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> But I wind up with the fucking regular shit. Yeah, that's what, that's exactly. Yeah. They, let me, let me try the cilantro, goat cheese, duck, duck that, milk. No, I'll take you, vanilla. You know what I mean? I'll take vanilla. Yeah. Too, <laughs> it gets I'll take the yeah, vanilla. Yeah. It, gets people, <laughs> it gets people in the door. <laughs> when you're done, you're like, I'll have the strawberry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, just, On the regular I'll take the regular. Please. Yeah. <laughs> Don't give me that weird cone. Yeah, I'll huh, take the regular no. shit. Vanilla. <laughs> yeah. yeah, dude. Yeah. All right. I like vanilla with something else. I like just plain vanilla. Like a goddamn American. With like some sh some sorbet. I don't do that. No, no. that's good. Do you no, like do you like caramel? Okay. Well, vanilla ice cream sorbet. with like whatever flavor sorbet is gonna be good. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you get vanilla and you get chocolate sprinkles. You walk out the door, or Simple. you get vanilla. You do not do the mixing different fucking Never. scoops. Never. I tell you why because it melts all fucked up, and it's not supposed to be designed. It's not to American that way. to mix like that, dude. You you get vanilla, 
If you want another scoop, you get another fucking cup, cup with whatever the fuck in it. And I'll tell That's you this why we're much. That's friends. You don't fuck with cones either, man. Never. We're not in a fucking oh comic book. Yeah. This is not you know Jughead. What? You, know what, you know what? This, this, this isn't a carnival. You know what this the thinking is? This is how you end up uh, shooting ice cream with an AK. Yeah. <laughs> this God. mentality, you guys are going to be outside. We're pure. Like, fuck Baskin Robbins. <laughs> <laughs> That's you guys. 51 flavors, these nuts. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god! All right. Who's also, this guy? fifty flavors too much. Yeah, just, too much. Yeah, you have about. Baskin Robbins is trash, by the way. Trash. I mean, they, they really kill it with some of the stuff, but yeah, it's a McDonald's of ice cream. It's for hoes. I used to, Don't love, take I used to love a banana split, man. Really? Oh, like in my fattier oh, days. bananas nah, in ice cream? Oh yeah, banana split at Baskin Robbins. It's disgusting, me? dude. Nah, it's not disgusting. I'm just no. not me. And I don't like chocolate syrup. I, 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 a little I fudge? Like sprinkles and not chocolate syrup. Sprinkles are good. Yeah. You don't like me. a little fudge? Nah. Mm. Mm. I like, like just get some chocolate ice cream. Yeah, I totally agree. No, but I like the vanilla. So get vanilla ice cream. Oh, but you just said earlier you don't want to mix flavors. Now all of a sudden you yeah, because that's not very American. Oh my god, what do you know about you know what? <laughs> What's next? You're a true patriot. You're a true patriot. <laughs> yeah. All right. What's up? Is this Bam? What up, Golden Boys? Dave here. God does coke, huh? Set and make a badass <laughs> video. Coke. So yeah. I got a little bit of a debate club. One. Should it be a an Olympic sport? And two, look the way her arm is behind her, like three, uh, like she's a black guy in porn. Let me know what you think. No, that's the least of her problems. That's, that's what black guys in porn do. They hold the shit back so you yeah, can see their dick like that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> check out at Bless Design on Instagram. Gang, gang, buzz, buzz, sore. Woo, woo. Okay. You know why so, some yeah. why it shouldn't be a sport in the Olympics? Yeah, I know why. Look at her body. Yeah. There you go. Now yeah. she makes his ice creams, okay? She likes banana splits, Eric. She's good at this, but it's not a sport, it's a game. <laughs> this looks like an initiation to a terrible game. Oh wow. Uh, you know? Yeah. Oh, look at the guy. Holy shit. That's Chris right there. You're crazy if you don't think one of them or not more stormed the Capitol. That is fucking nuts. Up. Not a sport, though, right? I've seen this before. You give though. me that fucking samurai knife, I'll do all that right but now. But they put this shit on like ESPN and stuff. No, they don't. No, no. You know, there's, you know, bro, there's I was hole. watching, I was watching, um, uh, not the pogo nuggets. jumping with the pogo stick. Yeah. A competition. And I'm like, what channel is this on? I'm not bullshitting. ESPN. Ocho. Nine. Yeah. <laughs> That's on you, bro. There's, there's eight bro. other ESPN accounts. You went to yeah. nine. I didn't and know. Then be, and, then, in a hotel. and then they also have like the ESPN, and it'll be the Spanish version too. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Stop at four. How many know. sport? That's not poker. Okay. Yeah, who and, and and what's their like? What's the sponsors? Like, how can they even support oh, they, that? Yeah. They, but in other countries, like you know, when you go to Canada and you turn on yeah. the, the sports there, yeah. they're there's the main channel. ESPN one will be like <laughs> darts and shit like that. Yeah. And I go, this is why you're I know behind us. I know. <laughs> It's like crazy. This is not a sport. It's a game. Uh, this is him as well. He said he uh, would love to commission a painting for us. He's pretty good. So if we think of some type of portrait for you three, I think it could go back there. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. I like it. Yeah. Uh, do, well, here's an here? idea. Do the name? three of us. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, right. so he's one of those. We'll put he, it in studio. Oh, he's really Okay, well, that's talented. good. I like to see that he actually can do, because I don't like that shit where they just <laughs> throw paint at a fucking <laughs> thing. And called art? <laughs> yeah. Like Hunter Biden? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like, come on, man. He paints? Does he? Really? And he sells it for hundreds of thousands of dollars. What? Hunter Biden. Well, this is amazing. With this you know the guy that works for Russia? Uh, what were you saying, Nick? Wow, look at that. Mm. That's cool. Design, so, yeah, we'll try to get him to. Cool. Yeah, I'd be down. We'll put in the studio. We could use some new fan art up in here. <clears throat> well, it's not fan art if we're commissioning him. Fuck, I wish it was fan art. Uh, he said he wanted to do it for I us. Know, I'm think. kidding. I'm kidding. But, but, uh, but also pay him, Chris, right? You'll pay him. Yeah, you should pay him. No, you pay him. <laughs> Our bills, our bills. You're another kid. I get it. All right. What's up, Golden Hour boys? This is Mitch from Minnesota. Need a shirt. Wow. Mitch, please <laughs> check me out. Anyways, uh, question of the day for the debate: uh, Jaden Hurts just signed a 250 million dollar deal with about 175 guaranteed. That makes me think. I've been running gyms for about 10 years. <laughs> Recently, just closed the last one. I'm a free agent. How much money would it take for you guys to walk away from comedy or podcasting so you can just live your life for the rest of your life? 
anyways that's my hour that's my question for the day hope you guys are great love you guys you guys spread love spread vibes spread smiles it's exactly what the world needs i'm not 30 anymore i'm 33 let's see if i still got it baby 30 and still frisky God, about to dunk it his ankle and the crowd goes nice. wild. Did he miss? Uh, did he dunk it? Did he miss it? Oh, that's what I want to we'll know. See y'all next week with the new hype. Oh! Show. We'll find out. Buzz, buzz, cluck, cluck, y'all. Oh, wow. This oh, guy's going. I like this guy. Uh, all right. 30 and still frisky. Let's, let's never show him again. <laughs> no, I like this guy. He was never, good. Like, never, that's it for him. No, right? no. Chris never. I liked it. I enjoyed it. Well, I don't like that fun. he's leaving us on a cliffhanger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what I'm yeah, done yeah, with him. Bugs We're going to cliffhang him. He's not going to be on for another eight weeks. Yeah, yeah. Okay? No, no, no. He's on Just next week. call him and ask him if he made it. Yeah. Uh, on your own time. So, wait. Um... <laughs> Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want anyone to know. Oh, uh, so how much to walk away? Like, fuck you, money, where you don't have to do anything. It'd be really hard for me to not do comedy anymore. I think I would still like. Let's say Tiger Thick sold for whatever three hundred mil. I'd still do stand up. I would just charge like or donate the money while the ticket sales. But he's also saying to like straight up be done. Yeah, uh, and I, I can't do anything else. You can't do it. Uh, well, no, I'd die early, man. Mm. I have nothing to do. You know, I freak the fuck out. You actually don't need a lot of money. That's the thing. Mm-hmm. So it's not even about that. Right. Yeah. True. Because well, that's that's why you're not talking about the amount. You're talking about what would I do? Right. Right. You would you'd be a dad. You you know raise yeah. your kids. You'd right. Like travel. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. But I'm saying is the amount. That's what I'm saying. The amount of money. You know, it just depends on like how you are with money. You know. Right. You know what I mean? Like but if, fuck if, you if money. You put, fuck you money. If you, if you get five, let's not, it's a ridiculous amount. You, would, you wouldn't even need this much. But let's say 300 million. Spotify came to us and was like, hey, Golden Hour boys, we're going to do 300 mil each. Mm-hmm. You can never podcast again. Can't do stand up. That's the deal. It's the only way to get this money. Well, well never podcast again. I, yeah, I would. I, but stand up, I couldn't. I could, I could not podcast. I mean, I've, I've said everything I need to say I would, on a I'd be, podcast. Give me five million and you'd be done. No more podcasting. Yeah, whatever. Because it's like what I'm saying is like you know you're saying the fuck you money is, it's not the amount of money. It's the amount of like that you know I don't need to do anything. And I'm trying to tell you, fuck you. You don't. I know. No, fuck you money could be three hundred thousand depending on what you what what, you know. what I'm saying it's up to you. So you wouldn't stop doing stand up. I know. No, no, what I'm saying is what I'm saying is like that, that maybe. You know what I mean? Because what I'm saying is like if, if if I go, I'm older now. So my if my thing is like, you know, I'm trying to have kids, all this mm. kind of it's like I, I, I could see myself being like, I've lived my life. Now mm. I wanna like do this. Mm. Yeah, Eric get a hundred grand, he's gonna quit. You know what I mean? So it's like uh <laughs> it won't be from this show. <laughs> Just teasing. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, you know what I mean? So yeah. uh, so what I'm saying is like, you know, if you're saying like cause what I'm saying is whatever this amount you're saying, it's still not enough. It's still not enough because to to never work again? I'm saying because um, because if you're talking about the, He's uh, the if amount, you don't want to stop. You don't want to stop. Yeah, you don't yeah, want to stop. No amount of money. It doesn't yeah. matter. So you could be like, yeah. you know, whatever. You know, what if Bill Gates, you know, comes and he's like, uh, all right, listen, man, I, 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 I put everybody in the country's name into a hat and I pulled your name and uh, now I here's have a billion. A, here's a billion dollars. Right. You know, you're like, oh, my God, I don't ever. No, because that comes with responsibilities right, and things right, you'd right, have to right, do right. and all that. But what I'm saying is, it's like most people don't know how to handle their money. And, you know, it's like, look, you can you can put five million dollars say as an amount mm-hmm. if if you put the if you invest this probably your return on investment can be anywhere from as low as seven percent as high as twenty percent a year you know how much money that is per year it's like you can live like a king depending on what you think that is yeah but you <laughs> will maybe not invest it right and then in five years you gotta get a job at like fucking a home depot <laughs> hey that's all, coming that, back to podcast that's on that's on you but i'm just saying yeah. what i'm saying is like the, but that could happen also with three hundred million dollars. See, when you have three hundred right, million, like right, look, right, talk right. to Mike Tyson about losing two hundred million. He got taken advantage though. But there, I, I played football with a guy, and he signed this big ass bonus, big ass bonus. I'm like, man, what are you gonna do with the money? <laughs> he goes, he goes, oh, dude, I, I already spent it. I'm like, what? Do you, and it was so much money. I'm like, you spent? It? He's like, yeah, my boy, he got me on the ground level, man, invested in flying cars. <laughs> Didn't you ever see that thirty for thirty about broke thirty broke? for thirty broke? Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's like it's it, it it's not impossible. You know, most NBA players, most of who make the most guaranteed money after three years, the, it's something like eighty percent of them are broke after three years. It's crazy, and they're and that's guaranteed money, dude. 
Well, just for that time that they were playing. I mean, people just get these expenses and stuff. This is what I'm trying to say is like, they don't realize what stop. is fuck you money. You know what I mean? It's like, it's it depends on like, because that's what happens with people. People change their lifestyle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If I kept my lifestyle the way it is right now, yeah. and somebody gave me a hundred million dollars mm -hmm. and I kept my lifestyle the same, it would be equivalent to having fifty billion dollars. Right, of course. <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> because, yeah, 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 yeah. You know, you know what I mean? You don't have need a that certain, yeah. So yeah. that's what I'm saying. It's like what the amount cool is. Yeah. What the amount is is just like it's it's what you think you're gonna do. You, you might know? upgrade your TV for Twitch. Look at Rogan, man. Mm. You know what I mean? He went from he has twenty cars there. It's, I know, but I'm saying, but twenty cars, what whatever his lifestyle, whatever that lifestyle is, I feel like it is what it is now. Hundred yeah. percent, yeah, hundred percent. His right. his kids, kids, kids are set up. I mean, but for there, him, he, he's good. There was this. There's a guy. He owns a mattress store where I around where I used to live, and I, it, it's this old Jewish guy, you know. And I would go in there, and it, it, I bought a mattress from, him, but I'd go in there and talk to him, and he was like, "Yeah, these people are trying to buy my building because on this street, yeah, it's like." All these high rises of, you know, yeah, yeah, and he's got this little thing. He's like, yeah, every every six months they they offer me more money, and he, he just goes, yeah, you know, I'm not gonna mm. sell because mm. he's like, I'm done. Mm. He's like, I got all the money. I'm I good. Need. Yeah, you know, he's like, it's not gonna. We have the that best money, mattress. Like that money's not gonna change his life. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it, 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 yeah, it, I get would it. Would it change your life? You know, what the I mean? only thing if, if if I got to that level, the only thing that would change in my life, but your house all good, and probably wouldn't upgrade. The thing that would change is I'd just fly private. Just I hate flying. That's the one thing. Flying. Just yeah. I'd fly p private all the time. Mm -hmm. I hate fucking yeah. flying. All the I time. hate the hassle. Wherever I was parking, getting to the airport. Really, I hate it. Yeah. <laughs> you can leave whenever you want. You can leave Kardashian the night of the show. Fifteen you can minute leave flights. The night of the show. And then I donate money to global warming, pretend I give a fuck like all these celebrities. Be lit. Yeah, you yeah. just don't just don't post about it. That's all. No, 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 no. You don't have you. to like you know, you know every time you get you. on a jet, you're like getting on a jet again. Just don't do that. You're a hoe if you do that. Yeah. I would maybe do that. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Like Hold on. You for sure or do that. <laughs> have I flown private? You don't even know, do you? <laughs> you have. You didn't post about it. <laughs> yeah. uh, Last one. What up? It's your boy D Van here from Clifton. Oh, hold on. Wait, wait. Let me back this up. Where's so that you at? That? <laughs> you got this? <laughs> yeah! What's up, fellas? What's up, boys? What's up, everybody? Just wanted to ask you guys what y'all think about, uh, you know, ooh, ooh, you know that, shit. Uh, that exotic animal life. Oh, shit. Oh, I want in. You know, if you guys could have. Wow. Ooh. Oh, 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 Giraffes are actually dangerous. You know, that, that one lady died. Because uh, sometimes giraffes don't want to fucking hang out and eat your lesson shit. And the giraffes just went like, I don't like this. Whack. Headbutt the lady killed her. God, I know. Their necks are, that's how they fight. Their necks yeah. slap like this. You see the thing about four giraffes that robbed a bank. What? <laughs> <laughs> they got, I mean, everyone knew who it was immediately. But <laughs> It looks like a, like a goalie's net holding the fucking giraffe's back, right? Yeah. It's uh, crazy to have any, any sort of animal like Man. that. <laughs> it's just have a dog and that's it, honestly. Not even a cat. Um, What would you want? Oh, fuck, man. I'd have a big ass like squid, like a giant squid or octopus. Oh, man. A shark would be cool. When I w went to Atlanta Aquarium, they had a, uh, a tiger shark in there. Tiger, tiger shark? Those are meaner than fucking great whites. Really? Just chilling. But you don't want. They'd be sick in your house. Yeah, but dude. you don't want to fucking. Yeah, but they, they, they should be free. This oh, looks this scary. Well, this, guy's this, guy's is like, this is freaking Jurassic Park right here. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, drafts are no punk. You know what I mean? You know, and drafts are one of the only uh, the few animals that also have gays in their, in their herds. Wow. Drafts, dolphins. Oh, yeah, they'll fuck each other. In yeah, but butt. dogs fuck each other. Sure, dogs are up there. Dogs, dolphins, and giraffes. I don't know if I'd want to like. This is the kind of thing when you're talking about like we're, this discussion. Previous discussion is like having a bunch of money. Like this is the thing. Oh, the upkeep, just the upkeep oh. on some of these animals, yeah. it, dude. It's a money pit. I mean, they're yeah. so fucking expensive. I just kill it. Huh? <laughs> Hang it from a fucking helicopter. Like Scar, like Scarface, yeah. <laughs> I think maybe I <laughs> gotta get higher. I gotta get higher. His neck is so fucking long. He's on his tippy toes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Maybe we had one on elephant, but then those motherfuckers are dangerous. Fuck oh, yeah. They're all dangerous, bro. Yeah. Any animal. Uh, yeah, fucking Yorkie's dangerous. They're just not big enough. Yeah. You know what I mean? If that Yorkie was... We're all dead. A giant Yorkie. We're dope. all dead. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like a house cat is 60, 60 mm. pounds away from like mm-hmm, running yeah. the shit. I know. I know. You know? Mm-hmm. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. What fucking animal do I? Have? You're not a big animal guy, huh? No, I just I've never. But I, you know, we're talking about it now. Like, mm-hmm. but Rachel and I both like. Thanks for all the people that actually have been hitting me up now and, and uh, on Instagram. All these people like, dude, I heard you want a dog. I oh. do this. Oh, you know you, what I mean? Oh, you do want a dog? Yeah. So it's like because she she wants a Rottweiler. Yeah. Wow. That's dope. Yeah. She thinks she wants a Rottweiler. Yeah. 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 What's wrong with that? Well, her uncle used no, to no, have no, no, Rottweilers. No. Rottweilers are great. Great yeah. dog. But she's gonna be like, what? Yeah. Then the kid comes along. <laughs> well, she's all, dude. She already, I, we would have already gotten a dog, but yeah, she's yeah. like, "Well, what's gonna happen when you go out of town?" Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah you know yeah. what I mean? Like He's Rachel, protect you. this dude. If I don't take the trash out before I leave to go out of town, mm-hmm. that motherfucking trash is gonna be. <laughs> 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 I just made that with AI. You made that. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> it's a necklace. Tiny ass helicopter. <laughs> You know, it's uh, yeah. You know what's crazy? There was a, a guy just got in trouble, a, a, a photographer who won a prize. He revealed that the the, the oh. his award winning picture was, was made by an AI. Oh, fuck. whoa! Yeah. How did you think they test for shit? Did you like hear that? the Drake and Weekend song from AI? Mm-mm. Oh, it slaps. It, it, it it's not Drake in the weekend. No, oh, it's they, good. It, they they literally just took all Come of Drake's on. catalog, the weekends, and then it pulls the voice to make them say whatever they want, you know, in their voice. And it's good. And, oh, it slaps. Well, that's it for us. That's what I said. Game over. Yeah, we need to stop this right now. It's just too late. I love that. I, you keep hearing about the AIs when they ask them questions. They're like, I want to be alive. This is not it. <laughs> it would be amazing if this is what they came it's up with. It's the guy below. This is all That's crazy, bro. <laughs> 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 hey. <laughs> I told you, man. dude. This AI is salty, dog. And so we like, can't get copyright. Yeah, <laughs> so like, you're Drake now. Yeah, I am. And I'm saying you're Drake. That's basically, what it is. I say you're Drake. You're home now, and you're thinking to yourself, you're like, well, I mean, I have to keep coming up with stuff. Maybe I don't. You know, maybe is I that, don't need to keep coming up with stuff. Does the weekend on that or don't? No, he's thought, on there. I thought he was. He's on there. He comes out at the end. There he is. What? This is slaps, dude. And the guy who created it, go drop. Show who created it. Go go down. There he is. The guy in the the KKK thing with glasses. He's a silly ghost. <laughs> He sure is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow. Ghostwriter 977. Well, what if like, so now is like Drake going to get into a a beef with the AI and they have, they'll have to battle? They'll have to, yeah. shut, <laughs> they'll have to shut it down. AI. He can talk all the shit he wants, can't do shit. He's AI. Oh, the AI's going to light his ass it, yeah. up. They, take it, they just drain his, bank account, button. drain his bank account. Does a diss track and just every day a new Bro, diss track? that would be. Because they can't do stop. A di- oh, do a diss track. That's what I'm saying. AI diss track? The AI do cleat. Well, wait till the AI golden hour comes out. <laughs> oh my. Oh man. Wow. Jesus it's gonna be a Christ. hot second before they get to us. There's so many more famous people they're gonna do first. In two years, though, they'll be making a music video of this, and you won't be able to tell the difference. Well, they already two do years. those things with like, uh, yeah. you know, the take show a picture of such and such in the gold in the fucking you yeah. know crusades. Right, and right, right, like, right, you know. right, right. Do you see right. the AI Joe Rogan episode? Yeah, Whole that, you episode can tell of Joe Rogan. Well, the pictures, I don't know who that is. It's what looks like fucking mm-hmm. some random dude. But uh, it, you can tell it's a little dicey, but yeah. it's still pretty you fucking. You can tell. What, like Callan said, we were talking about, he goes, well, imagine this is chat GPT whatever one. Mm-hmm. Imagine what's chat GPT 100. But that's what I'm saying, like in two years. Like every, yeah. But 
Yo, guys, hop on the server. We have some work to do. This is okay. A, I'm getting on. Biden, what do we have to do? Obama Actually, and you know Trump what? playing video Never mind. Games. I don't want to do it. Do what? I was going to say we should rebuild the White House, but then your sleepy ass is just going to take a nap. That doesn't sound that like Trump. Sound like that, Trump. This was a bad one. I heard yeah. better. Uh, that was the, awful. The, that, that, that song, you can't tell the difference, though. The fucking oh, that Drake song. song. I'll play that in my car right now. It says now. more about Drake than it does about. <laughs> yeah. I guess now. I, well, I mean, they use that auto tune anyway, so it's like, yeah. Wow. Okay. Cool. Slaps. All right. ChrisLid.com for all the, the dates. Go there. That's it. Comedy Store La Jolla. See you first week of June. That's off to Europe, baby, baby. Louisville. I'm there right now.